everybody, I'm just showing you today a tutorial on how to remove gel nail varnish. I'll show you what I'm going to be using in my video today. This is a Gelux Profile Remover. It's pure acetone, that's what you're going to need to remove gel nail varnish. You'll also see me using this, it's a wooden cuticle stick. You'll also need these. These are shellac foil wraps. And you'll see here it's got a link free pad stuck to it. And that's what I'll wrap around my nails. And then you'll need some spare link free pads to remove any excess later. So I'll get started. So I'm just going to pour a bit of the acetone remover here and then you just put your nail in it there and you have this sort of flat thing at the bottom so to get any access and you just wrap it around your finger and fold it over so it's really easy and simple to do at home it will take about 10 to 15 minutes for it to, to break through layers. So I'm just going to continue wrapping my nails and then I'll come back and show you how to take it off once it's ready to come off. So my foils have been on for about 10 minutes so I'm going to take it off and uh, see what it looks like, see whether it's ready to come off. So we can see that it's already breaking up, so it's not going to take a lot to remove it. So all you need is this um, flatter edge of your cuticle stick. All you need is the flatter edge for flatter edge of the cuticle stick and you go from your cuticle to your tip not the other way around and you just can it, you can see easily flaking off some bits might need to take a little bit longer I would say be careful not to, to dig into your nail because they'll be very soft from soaking in acetone for that amount of time because you will end up damaging your natural nail so I'm going to pop my foil wrap back on because this isn't ready to, to come off yet but you can see how simply it comes off. So I'll come back in a few minutes when it's ready to come off. So I've put left the foils on for about another five minutes so hopefully it will be all ready to come off. So you just sort of gently prise it off and like I say be careful because it will affect your natural nail so you can see that's what it will look like once it's all off so I'll continue to uh, take the excess off It really is simple to do and it can save you tons of money having to go to the salons to have it professionally removed. This one's not quite ready. So as you can see all my gel nail varnish has come, come off 
and I get a lint free pad with some acetone on it and I just wipe over my nails and that will get rid of any excess varnish and then what I, th I think a good thing is to do after you've got it all off is obviously put some nail cuticle conditioner in so if you want your gel nails to last you need to look after your nails so I use a CND nail and cuticle conditioner and all you need to do after you've got all it off just dab a bit around your nail and rub in and then allow it to dry and then that will really look after your nails and boost nail growth so I hope my tutorial has helped you in, in showing you how easy it is to take gel nail varnish off at home. Thanks for watching.